Hi, I'm back. Megan Boone here. I just wanted you to see what I've done since my last video. I um, added some white and perked that little thing up a little bit. And my little bird right here seemed to just kind of fade into the paper, so I didn't like that. So I kind of whited it out and I'm letting it dry as I'm speaking to you right now. And yeah, it's dry. I'm going to paint back over it just to make it come alive. I even chose, yeah, that white wants to come in there and make it a little bit more pink than what I really wanted, but uh, I'll work with that. Since this is watercolor and it just kind of wants to blend in there, see what I'm doing? That's okay. It's still cute. I still like that little bird. His little nose just his little beak disappeared, but I'll bring that back to life here in a minute too. Um, but uh, yeah, I uh, I use a white pen. I it's a Signo pen. Um, you can get those from um, Michaels or online also. Um, but yeah, I like to use the color Sharpie markers too. Here's some of the markers I like to use and then I, I just kind of mix it up. I've got the Faber-Castell markers and just um, their pit artist pens. I really like those too. Um, yeah, uh, this is a lot of fun. Um, I hope you enjoy creating a journal page. And uh, I'd like to hear back from you if you want to leave a, me a comment. And you can also check out my Joyful Art Studio blog spot. Um, I would love to hear feedback, what you think about the video. And uh, also, you can visit me at Megan Boone on Facebook. Also, my Joyful Art Studio on Facebook. Thank you. God bless. And um uh, have a great day. Good night.